Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to use ImageJ, upload videos to it, take measurements, and all that good stuff. So we're going to double click on ImageJ. The window will pop up, and then we want to double click on ImageJ again. It's start popping up and loading right here. As you can see, the toolbar is already loaded right here. What I'm going to want to do is go to File Open to find a picture. Let's minimize this. I have one already set up here. It doesn't have a scale bar, but we'll just pretend that it does. And I'll show you how to set the scale up and measure the distance between lions, the area of a lion, and any sort of that stuff on just a vi visual image, a digital visual image. So it's pretty. It's a large picture right now. So I'm going to shrink it down so it can be in the whole view of the video. Right there, moving it a little bit. So right now, what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to set the scale bar. So what I'm going to do is come up here, click on the line, straight segmented freehand line. Just click on that. Let's just say from ear to nose. Let's just say that's one foot. I don't know the exact end distance but let's just say it's one foot normally you'd have a scale bar here just a ruler that you could have in the picture or something you know the distance of and then you'd, you'd use that as your measuring point but we're gonna go set scale come over here and known distance what I say one foot so we'll just try that FT for feet press OK and now I'm gonna come up here and click on straight line and let's let's just see the distance between the two lions. Go up straight line, click, drag over, come up here to measure. And there it is. There's our length. We have our length in feet. So 1.12 feet. Now, let's say we want to do a segmented line. So say we want to go from his ear right here to the nose, then to the then to the other lion, then to the ear then to the eye. So what we're going to do, click on this, double, right click on it, go to segmented line, ear to nose, to the lion, to the ear, to the eye. You can right click and that finishes it out or you can double click and that finishes it out. So we go to analyze, measure, and we can see it right there, it's 3.74 feet. So now if we want to do area, we come up here and we click on the polygon section. And what we do is we just click, and each click is just another marker point in your area folder. So we're just going to go with the frontal area view of a lion. And you don't have to be precise with your clicks because after it you can manipulate them pull them in, pull them out to help you with your finer imaging and then we're going to come up here to analyze, measure and voila right there there's our area 2.33 feet squared and that's how you use image J and you can copy this these data points by copying them and then plugging them into Excel, Microsoft Excel, so you have your lengths right there and your area right there. And that's how you use it.